second or third starter in this Cub rotation as they push toward the postseason? Well, probably for the Cubs' sake, they, they hope that he's not that, because then that means the other guys aren't throwing well at all. They got him for next to nothing. It, it, it's basically taking a flyer, come on over, let's see if the change of scenery, putting you in a, in a pennant winning or, or, or pennant chasing situation. Right. You know, how are things going to change? And, and look, he's playing for a, one of the top teams in all of baseball, so his performance should be elevated. The Cubs have nothing to lose. They really, really don't. Yeah, and I know the, you were in a situation where you kept hearing when you were pitching, hey, I might get traded. I might. Hamill said that was going on. Even as a veteran, you try to block it out, but he was relieved, and he, and he looked comfortable tonight. Uh, yeah, he definitely looked uh, on the same page with Contreras, and Contreras does a good job of game calling. So after the first stealing, they, they got on the same page, and they got settled in. But it's a lot of pressure. It's a lot of pressure on your family when you hear your name swirling around. You're even on the mound thinking, is this my last day pitch? in the Rangers uniform. Now he's in settled in a contender. He's a World Series MVP. He has a chance to audition and show the brass that he can pitch in the postseason run. Did a hell of a job so far. Yeah, we'll see when he pitches for his home team at Wrigley uh, how, how that holds up. It's uh, <laughs> coming off the disabled list. Back on July 6th, the numbers on Carrasco. And overall, when he's healthy, he's good. 13-5, and five, his record. But this is really impressive. So, you know, we, we talked a little bit before uh, about what Cole Hamels can do for the Cubs. I mean, is Carrasco, uh, you know, is he maybe the best starter at this time for the Indians since Kluber hasn't exactly been healthier at his best? His last seven starts, he's 5-1 and one, one with a 3 RA, 44 strikeouts, this 5 Ks, and that's what makes him dominant is he doesn't waste pitches, he attacks the strike zone with all his repertoire of pitches, and he works at a phenomenal play, a pace, so that's why you see great defense behind him. The only thing that hinders him is every time he gets going, he has to, uh, some type of injury, a broken hand, a hamstring, takes a liner off the elbow. But if he's able to get his reps in and stay in there, he's definitely one of the best starters in the AL. You know, I, I'm still with that Indian staff outside of Kluber, the next guy I put on the mound, Trevor Bauer. Right. I mean, he, he's, having, he's having another unbelievable yeah. season, and he continues to improve the breaking ball, the fastball, the ability, as Don Trell would say, you know, the ability to spin it. He's thrown more innings than anybody in Major League Baseball. He's got an ERA just over two. The strikeouts are in the top two or three. And the other thing, he's only given up seven home runs. Because he's got a nasty whooper well, duper. He does. <laughs> you know what, like for me, for a guy, if I'm playing behind him, I know that that guy's taking the ball and he's not giving it up. I mean, his arm could be ready to fall off and he's right. going to say, I'm it throwing another pitch. And there's something to be said about that. And, you know, that... That's the type of guy that you want to you want to go to battle with. Yeah, he's faced more batters uh, than anybody in baseball. So uh, this yeah, no, he he the wants a ball. He's not yeah. giving it up. He <laughs> competes. But what about uh, Carrasco? I, I was surprised he's only had one uh, postseason appearance. So you would, I, he's always been down. So you know, you always worry about every year you see the Indians go into the postseason. Man, we wish we had Carrasco yeah. to be able to go and be the number two. If he goes up against somebody's number three, besides the Houston Astros, I think he's winning that matchup to any so, other number three in all of baseball, so they need to keep him healthy. And that's why look, the Indians, I mean, you, we talk about the division they play in. Okay, they've, they've had some issues in the bullpen. Kluber, Bauer, Carrasco. Good luck. And then Lindor, and as you'd like to say, Ramirez, who's on our, our <laughs> highlight bag. It's like yeah. the Ramirez show every night. And yeah. if you get with Brad Hand, you get Miller healthy well, that's the in thing. the bullpen. Now you can play the matchup, yeah. too. Yeah. That's they're already they are not fun. So, yeah, They're post, not fun to play post, against. Now they have a 10-game lead after, after that win tonight in the AL Central.